What's up everyone, I'm Micah. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. In this video, I figured I'd just focus on something that's pretty simple and also pretty common to wear during the winter season, and that is just simply puffer coats. I'm just gonna give you all some different ways to style them, and you know, just some different tips, I guess, on when you're wearing them, and you know, just how to style it and what to wear it with. So, let's go ahead and get into it. Before jumping right on into the first outfit, I figured I'd just go ahead and point out that puffer coats are something that are just pretty simple to wear. I mean, you can pretty much wear anything with them. Like, now that I'm thinking about it, I don't think there are any restrictions. I mean, you know, nothing's restricted, obviously, but I don't think there's any restrictions on what you can and can't wear with it. Like, just thinking about it, I would say you can wear sweatpants, you can wear jeans, you can wear your chinos, the work pants, and you know, all those different types of things. I feel like you can wear them with puffer coats. I mean, it's just a very simple thing to wear. So. Just jumping right on into the first outfit here. This guy has on this mocha brown color, and I don't think this is the exact one, but there's a the North Face puffer that's really caught my attention, and I've trying to been, I've just you know been trying to find it, and it's just like a mocha brown North Face puffer. I mean that that's all it is to it. And here, like I said, he has on this brown puffer coat, and under that, it's just kind of an interesting outfit too. So that kind of you know caught my attention as well. Uh, looks like a. It's kind of like cut at the bottom, but it's a regular button down. He has it with a tie, but he paired it with some baggy sweatpants and some boots. I have no idea what brand these boots are, but this is just a very interesting outfit. Yeah, like I said, just caught my attention. And I don't know if this is something I would wear, but it is nice. And I just really want to show it just for a different combination and also just pairing it with some sweatpants since this is kind of one of the only ones I found with sweatpants, but you can definitely wear sweatpants with a puffer coat and it'd be perfect for the winter season. Now in this next outfit, I figured I'd show it with a bit of layering and layering is obviously something that you're gonna be doing a lot and lot during the winter season. And as you see here, this guy has on, and I don't even know what you'd call this color. Like, it's not green, but it's not brown, but I feel like it's like the perfect mixture of those colors. Like, it's kind of like a green and brown mixture. Under that, he has on this gray hoodie. He has on a beanie, and it looks like a mask, too. I can't tell if that's a mask or like a ski mask, but I'm just going to go with a mask. Like, you know, the surgical mask, like a COVID mask. Uh, he paired that with some jeans, and these are just some super baggy or oversized jeans. And he also has on these neon orange shoes. I have no idea what brand those are, but I just really wanted to show it with the jeans, you know, just for another way to style it since I had the sweatpants and now the jeans. And they could just pretty much be paired with anything like I said earlier, but just showing you all an example with jeans here. Now moving on to this third outfit, and I was considering doing a video like specifically talking about different pants to wear, but a very common type of pants that I've seen a lot of people wearing lately, and not just lately, but I guess in the last few years, well, they've become trendy since this has always been pretty popular, but they've become trendy in the last few years, and this is like cargo pants here, so I figured I'd show it with a puffer coat. And as you see here, this guy just has on this regular black puffer, these kind of like gray, green or grayish colored uh, cargo pants, and these boots and I'm not sure what type of boots those are I feel like I've seen a good amount actually and I really don't know and I feel like I should know but uh, as you see here just some more layering he paired that with the beanie and the hoodie you can kind of see the hood coming out the back of the puffer coat but besides that you can't really see the whole outfit obviously since it's sideways but I just wanted to show it here with the cargo pants since that's something that's also very common and any shoes would be fine you know with this outfit obviously some type of sneaker like Sambas or New Balance or Jordans you know any type of sneaker you may have or boot I guess it would still look nice with the puffer coat and the cargo pants now here in this fourth outfit this is someone that I think has just perfect style and this is Manu Rios he's like a Spanish uh, actor influencer whatever model also, you know, just a couple of different things, but he just has great style in my opinion. And here he has on this black puffer coat, um, this like a dark gray hoodie on under it, paired with some, I guess you call these cargo pants. They kind of look a little like parachute pants since they have like the strings and stuff at the bottom, but just paired them with some black combat boots. And this is just another very simple outfit. All the outfits are going to be pretty simple. I feel like the only one that's not simple was the first one, but that's kind of an outlier when it comes to wearing puffer coats and stuff. Since, you know, most people don't do stuff like that when they wear puffer coats. They just kind of keep it simple since the main goal is to stay warm. So this is just another perfect example here of how to wear it during the winter time. And finally, the only way that I haven't shown so far, and this is with like dress pants or slacks, whatever you want to call it. And these are some pleated dress pants that the guy has on. He has on this black, the North Face Puffer, these like dark green colored dress pants are really nice. And he paired it with the, you know, the simple black and white low dunks or dunks low. 
the black and white dunks, you know what I'm talking about. And uh, you really can't see what else he has on. I mean, he may have on like a sweater or something on under that or a sweatshirt. Can't really tell, but the pants, the combination of the puffer, the pants, and the shoes is just really nice in my opinion. And with the accessory that he has on, the, I guess you call it tote bag or something that he's carrying, it's like a checkered coat bag. Could actually be a book bag. That looks more like a book bag now that I'm analyzing it a bit more. But it's just a really nice outfit. Very simple, like I said. It's most likely gonna be simplistic if you wear a puffer since you can't really do too much with it since it's like so big and bulky, it kinda just, limits your options but still a nice outfit so those are just some different outfits that I want to show you all as I've said before I just want to you know just kind of go in detail on puffer coats and just give you all some different ways to style it and as you saw throughout the video it's pretty simple I mean you can't really do too much with a puffer coat it's just kind of the puffer coat a hoodie or sweatshirt you know like a long sleeve or t-shirt something like that some pants and some shoes I mean that's pretty much every outfit but I feel like just in regards to puffer coat it just kind of has to be pretty just you know simple and not doing too much so that's why I figured I'd just throw in that very first outfit just to show one that was doing it's not doing too much but it's just kind of different and compared to the other four that are just you know pretty casual pretty simple so anyway I hope you all enjoyed this video don't forget to like it if you did enjoy it subscribe to my channel because I post on here twice a week and follow me over on Instagram as well at Micah Aikens just so you can keep up with me see everything that I'm doing see what I'm wearing and I will see you all in the next video